We usually think of the Moon in orbit around the Earth as the Earth stays still. But that's not quite right. Actually, they're both in orbit. They're in orbit around a point called the common centre of mass of the Earth-Moon system. So essentially what's happening is something like that, although it's quite difficult to do. Now, when things rotate around in circles, other forces come into play. In this case, a force called the centrifugal force. So that's a force you'd feel if you're hanging onto a roundabout going faster and faster and you have to hang on tighter and tighter because of the force trying to throw you off. That's the centrifugal force. Now, let's bring the Moon back. So now there are two forces at play in this system. There's a gravitational pull of the Moon, trying to pull everything towards it, and there's that centrifugal force trying to throw everything off. But think about the ocean here. That's closer to the Moon, and so the Moon's gravitational pull wins, and you get a tidal bulge. Now think about this point on this side of the Earth. That's farther away from the Moon, so the centrifugal force wins, throwing the water off and you get a tidal bulge. And now the Earth just rotates underneath those tides once a day and that's why you get two tides every day.